So hi everyone, in today's video is not about mental health related, but it's kind of related. So you get a point, right? I hope so. Um, anyway, I've been searching for my purpose of life for quite a long time. It's like I'm getting lost in this world. And when I got my depression, I kind of struggle finding my purpose in this life. Actually, the thing that I want to talk about is about education. You know, people uh, graduate school and they go to college right after they graduate. They, they are high school, right? But in my opinion, please take a note, in my opinion, is. I think it's not uh, the right decision to go to the college right away because number one, it's a waste of time number two, it's a waste of money number three, you don't even know yourself at, the, at that age but hear me out, this is based on my personal experience where I just blindly and unknowingly took a degree you know like I want to go to this college and study this without knowing the result or what am I going to be after I graduate I, I have no idea I have I have no goals I have no purpose a firm purpose yeah I just have no idea then after I graduate I start looking for a job, right? But at the time, I got uh, something that really tra traumatized me when I'm doing an internship in one of the bank in Jakarta, and I got a lot of issues there. A uh, part of it is because of my fault, but I think. In my opinion, most of it is because they can't handle me because I have a different personality and different way of thinking, the way of speaking. They just don't understand how to um, treat me well. But yeah, I don't want to blame anyone here, but that's what happened. So I got into the internship and I have no idea what they, they are giving me like the things that they ask me to do I have no idea what it is the work environment is not friendly I would say uh, it's not like a college life where you are always happy you're hanging out with friends you study together you work on things together but in the work environment at the time when I'm in my internship it's really different everyone is busy with themselves they don't have time to guide you and you have to do things by yourself which brings us to one point that I learned to start from zero again when you work you see Everything that I learned from my college is just useless, you know, not, not, not entirely useless. What you learn from the college, you will only use it for like, like 10 or 15% I would say. And after I finish my internship, I start to uh, do interviews, finding a job, like typical person after graduate. At the end, I got a job, but it's not related with my college degree. It's yeah, it's totally different. I work as a sales, as a data analyst, as a shopkeeper in a luxury brand, as a designer, and marketing and communication, which is not related with what I learned in my college 
I'm I I studied in information system anyway. So it's totally not relatable. But I do a good job and I got a lot of good result when I work. And you know what? It's because it's not relatable with my college degree. I have to learn from zero again. That's really really not hard. Why? Because there's something called Google. There's something called brain. There's something called IQ. What I'm trying to say is you are capable of anything if you have brain. Okay? Back to the first topic statement that I'm trying to say is it's not ideal for people like me like me okay it's not ideal for people like me to go to the college after I graduate my high school because at the end when you go to the outside world you find a job you have to learn again from zero okay that's about learning again from zero uh, but let's talk about the purpose of your life okay uh, most people will say about do something that you like you passion about at a young age like high schoolers they are not really know about themselves yet they are still exploring the world they, and exploring themselves that take me to this thinking okay again this is my opinion for you to know or fully know about yourself you have to explore right which what we are doing when we are young we are curious about things about life about the world so for me I start to to discover my purpose of life like a month ago okay I'm 29 now 29 years old and I just discovered my purpose of life like a month ago okay for me it's about helping people it's about serving people it's about I lift people up I help them right now what I do is I heal people with uh, acupressure acupressure uh, I heal people at home and that's helping people and also I'm really into mental health because me myself I have mental health issue and I start to have this interest I'm building this interest about learning people about learning mental health about learning personality I, I'm really interested in that now and I have a plan that I want to uh, go to the college again to study again at the university about psychology or I can be a doctor and I want to be a psychiatrist so you see in my life I wasted a lot of my time and my money. I went to Venus Uni University and study information system. Uh, for me personally, I think it's a waste of money for me and a waste of time. Please take a note in my opinion, okay? It's based on my experience and what I think. It might be different for you. But I'm not saying that going to university at a young age is a waste of money and, t and, and time. But for me, it is. Okay? You will learn 
one or two things when you go to university at a young age but mostly about discipline study uh, socializing learning new things anyway what I'm trying to say in my video is you have to consider more before you invest your time and your money to study something that you think at the young age is will be useful for your future and as for a parent uh, you have to really observe your children more carefully really see what they are really good at and what they really want not because of your su suggestions not because of friends telling that be a doctor is a good thing or be a pilot be a nurse be a lawyer for a brighter future but at the end it's useless it's far from what your child really want you know so my suggestion maybe after they graduate from high school just ask them to work with people I know for office work you will need a degree but there's also something out there that doesn't have that doesn't require you to have a degree to work you know it's about experience it's about exploring the world and after a few years if your child is grown up you can ask them again do you want to study what do you like and the answer will be different from their young versus when they grow up because they might be found their purpose of life and they, they want to enrich themselves and use the knowledge to be someone that they really want okay so that's it for today and if you're wondering why I'm using English in my video it's because I realized that I have some friends that are from outside of Indonesia uh, I used to use in an in Indonesian language in, in my previous video but I want to reach out to my international friend so they will understand what I'm trying to say in my videos okay so that's it for today's video and I hope you can take one of two things that are useful from my video and I would like to say sorry if I have a error in my grammar because I don't really learn English in a proper way I learn it by myself through videos through books and talking to international friends yeah so I don't have a proper grammar that's what I'm trying to say okay I'm sorry about that and anyway thank you for watching and see you on my next video. Bye-bye!